fucking laugh my ass off. I'm all day. Hell up now. Oh, you said all day, so I know they don't include me. <laughs> wow, you definitely <laughs> dropped a donut the first game. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yo, 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 what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Dirty Dave here. In this video, we're gonna be attacking Aviator in Games Room here on Villa. So, going with our team composition, we're gonna be taking Habana, Jackal, and IQ every single time. Habana, because there's not that much hard breaching we need to do, and it's best out of range. Jackal, because this is a roamer heavy map, and also with a secondary shotgun, he's like a secondary bug and can destroy from underneath. IQ, sim similar to Jackal, she can shoot out the gadgets from underneath, and they're also both fraggers, so they're great at hunting roamers. Now for our fourth and fifth pick, I really like Glass, but you can also take back Blackbeard since they kind of do the same role, but I like Glass, he's pretty powerful seeing through smokes. Now for our fifth pick, is be between Doki and Zofia. I'm liking Doki more because she has smokes for Glass. But Zofia is really versatile and she can take out those evil eyes. But she also has range soft breaching, which is very useful for Villa since it has a lot of buffer rooms. So, yeah, we're going to be taking Doki and Glass in our main three. So let's get right to it. Going over the spawns, I think Runes is the best because one, it's the closest and it's also pretty safe since you have a bunch of walls to cover you. So runes is probably the safest spawn and it's the closest spawn. Main road, uh, they're pretty sa it's pretty safe, but it's far away. Fountain, it's the most vulnerable to spawn peaks, but I wanna worry about spawn peaks right there. So just something to always check is to watch out for this window, especially if you're sitting on the balcony. Watch out for that window if you're sitting on that balcony because that's just a direct flank. So I just kinda wanna set up the scene for you guys in a way. Just so you kind of know what's going on. So, Glaz and Doki, they're going to be coming up here on the balconies. Glaz can be on this balcony. Doki on that one. It doesn't matter. It can go the other way. So, right here, this is the aviator room. So, right there, the sights in there, too. Perfect. And then over here is bar. So, usually, they're going to have a mirror. And they're going to put them on this wall. And then right here, on that wall for an aviator. This is where they're going to have the mirrors and then glass. So if you can take out those mirrors, having like just a range sharpshooter like glass and Doki with their DMRs, this is just great. If you can take out those mirrors, they have a lot of good at control of OBJ. So they're going to be sitting here and waiting for the other people to do work. So Habana, Jack on IQ are going to be down low. Habana is just going to cover them and drone out for them and always to make sure to save your drones down here so you can you won't get cut off track by roamers so right here this is to take out the bar mirror so right there this is the bar mirror and you can see that pre-made hole that I just showed you guys so right there you can take it out and also a useful thing is you can smoke out for glass as well so what you want to do is just make sure you put like the side of the crosshair, the grenade crosshairs between the bars and just throw it and it's a useful smoke for glass. And over here the aviator, uh, the aviator mirror, so you want to go from the second full block or square from the wall and all the way to the right. Just take out this square completely. So right there you can see the pre-made hole and then you can also smoke out for glass over here. The heck, we'll move right there so it's pretty useful to take out the mirrors and smoke it out and glass can use it towards his advantage and then over here in vault so let me show you guys a nice drone so you're gonna want to drone out vault and just use this drone all right here to check where they are in vault because you can practically destroy any destroy anywhere from below so right there that was my drone in vault you go over here into this secret room and then just start destroying all the way. So over here, this is a vault we're destroying. And then IQ can throw her grenades or whatnot. So that's pretty good. And then to get the other half, you have to go over here in the hallway. So kind of the middle of this arch, just go across. 
So you just want to join out so you can get them right away, make sure, and then throw the grenades up through there. So, and also a nice thing about Jackal, he can track the defenders through the floor. So, I guess, say you get mirror off the mirror, off the window, and you don't kill her, but you see, you destroy the window, but then you see her footsteps, you can track her from below. And then with her tracking her, she's probably going to sit still. May, maybe make a doki call to make her sit still while she's being tracked. And then you can shoot her from below. So right there. And also, a nice thing, synergy with doki and IQ. When they go on their phones to turn off the, the hack or the phone call, IQ can see them on their phones and also shoot them from below. So that's pretty good synergy right there as well. So... Yeah, I think that's what's covered. Once IQ takes out gadgets from below, Jackal takes out the mirrors and probably tracks someone and kills them. Uh, IQ and Jackal can go hunt roamers if they want. Um, who, would, who would have the bomb? I think um, probably IQ should have the bomb. If Jackal's going to go hunt roamers, IQ can come back up here in the hallway because she's going to be next to OBJ. But the thing that Habana's going to do, she's going to take out the vault wall from outside. So, right here, repel up from this window straight across the vault, she can open it up, and right there, that's a vault right there, so she can cut off the rotation on vault. And also, she can cut off rotation on hallway as well from the window, so then IQ would come up. Glass will probably take out anyone who's from below. Jackal can breach from below if he wants as well. Just go to the left of this. And then IQ can plant here safely. Glass can see through the mirrors. Habana has control of hallway and vault. And it's just, it's a done deal after that. Gla uh, Jackal can stay underneath and when they plant the bomb, he can just watch the bomb from below and shoot whoever tries to defuse it if it comes down to like a 1v1 or something you can just sit below and shoot the de the diffuser the defender from below so yeah that's practically it for the strat mainly using that vertical play and those smokes to your advantage take out those mirrors and let Glasgow ham doki IQ synergy jackal checking through the floor it's a it's pretty dirty and I think the strat will do you guys well. So yeah, that's it for the video. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like and if you want more dirty Dave, subscribe. Till then, see you guys next time.